Hey, what's going on guys? It's Scott and today I'm alone. <laughs> I just realized how like pathetically sad I looked when I said that. The reason why I'm a little sad is just because Shanna and Ellie are not here. And the reason why they're not here is because I just dropped them off at the airport where they are going to be flying out to Lompoc, California to go spend a week with Shannon's mom. I'm really happy for them. I know they're excited to go out there as well. It's going to be kind of a trying day because Shannon's going to be having Ellie on her lap for the whole trip. Um, but... Um, yeah, they're going to be flying into Santa Barbara and someone's going to pick them up and they're going to go to Lompoc. They're going to have an awesome week. Shannon took our normal camera and she's going to be covering a bunch of that trip. So I'm excited to see that footage too because uh, I've never been to California and I would actually love to see some video of where she's going. So um, yeah, so she's going to be doing some vlogging out there which will stick up on YouTube after they get back. Uh, but I am flying solo. Guys, I'm normally a stay-at-home dad with Ellie. So without a little girl to take care of, my week is wide open. So what am I going to do? You would think I'd be watching movies, maybe playing some games, reading some books, you know, enjoying my freedoms as just a guy with nothing else to do, sleeping in, not waking up in the middle of the night to a crying toddler. And with all of that said, I'm still sitting here going, yeah, but I would trade all of that in just to be able to go to the Children's Museum with Ellie and Shannon today. Like, I, I miss them already. They've only been gone for an hour and I'm already missing them. But I'm going to make the most of it and I'm going to be doing that today first by enjoying my mom's birthday. Today is my mom's birthday. So I went to the store. I got a birthday cake. A couple of nights ago, we already celebrated uh, with Ellie and everybody, the whole family, we went over and hung out with my, my parents. But I'm going to go over. It's my mom's birthday. So I'm going to go over, bring over a birthday cake. Uh, I rented a movie from Redbox, The Arrival. I'm looking forward to watching that. And uh, I want to be productive this week. I'm going to clean the house, get it like really scrubbed up and clean. Uh, going to look for another place to go move because uh, our family really wants to move out of the apartment that we're in. I'm going to go hang out with some friends this week, and I'm, most of all, I'm going to bring you guys with me on this. So uh, while I'm vlogging here, Shannon and Ellie are going to be vlogging in California. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to keep our channel very busy over the next couple of weeks. So with that said, let's get this day started. Okay, so this day just took an epic twist for awesomeness because now I'm at my mom's house, and we're celebrating her 60th birthday, and we just ordered some to-go steak from Longhorn Steakhouse and it's my mom's birthday now you guys haven't seen my mom since that epic baby bomb video that we did last year well we released it a few months ago but it was from last year when Ellie was only six months old and a lot of life has happened since then and and speaking of a lot of life my mom represents a lot of life because today she's 60 years old oh stop Oh, uh, anyway, so how's your birthday been so far? Very good. Awesome. Yeah. You've had some friends come over, yes. bring some stuff over throughout the week. Mm -hmm. Ellie's gone today. Mm -hmm. She flew out to L.A., so you probably would have liked to have hang out with, with Ellie, but, but they're having a good time. Actually, I just found out that Shanna and Ellie made their flight into Charlotte, and uh, now they're, I think at this point, they're on a plane heading from Charlotte, mm -hmm. North Carolina to Phoenix, uh, so we're really excited about what's going on with them. Uh, so far, so good. Shannon told me Ellie has been pretty good on the airplane, so that not too bad hopefully the person sitting next to them really likes kids but anyway we are getting ready to go i know that could be kind of hard if if, if they didn't because you we know love Ellie. that's true unless you just don't like kids and then you know the mom with the toddler twisting and turning everywhere playing with toys going no mama i want this mommy and then and then when ellie starts going mama nurse Mommy, nurse, nurse, <laughs> nurse, and then not only that, then you're sitting next to the breastfeeding mom. So, I mean, hopefully, uh, hopefully it's somebody who understands. Although, uh, Shannon's really good. I'll tell you one thing about Shannon. She's really, really sensitive about how people feel about that. So, for Shannon, like, she's just not going to start nursing Ellie in, next to somebody who, without probably at least asking first i don't know we'll see shannon's really discreet about that so anyway we are headed the longhorn we're gonna get some takeout then we're gonna come back here and eat some really good food 
<clears throat> my mom does not go to steak houses, um, which is why we're bringing the steak house to her today. <laughs> um, but I, I mean, yeah, I kind of had to trick her into this because my mom's kind of a low key person, right? I mean, you're the kind of person that we say, hey, what do you want to do today? And you're like, whatever, mm -hmm. right? And then we say, hey, what do you want to eat today? And you're like, oh, whatever. And then you're like, hey, pick whatever you want. And you're like, I guess just a simple sandwich from Subway, oh. you know? But but today I kind of manipulated mom by asking her a question. Now, I don't really understand why she didn't know where I was going with it, but I said, okay, let's pretend that today is your last day what are you going to eat? Like you can choose any meal you want. And finally she's like, I would choose steak. And I thought I would never think of that, like her ever saying that. And I thought you want a steak dinner? And she's like, yeah. And I was like, and then boom, we went on Longhorn. And the whole time she's like, oh, let me pay for it. Let me pay for it. So very generous, but not today. Today it's all, all me. Aww. So um, yeah, so we're gonna go pick it up. My dad's going with me. We're gonna go take a ride out towards the mall and uh, let's keep going. Steak, here we go. All right, so we got back from Longhorn Steakhouse and we've already eaten steak in a really weird strange. kind of strange way. It was kind of ghetto, really, the way that we did it. <laughs> it was uh, basically, my parents live in a, a really bad apartment situation the same way that we do. So, um, and their landlord showed up unannounced and said hey i'm here to do plumbing and we just sat and ate an expensive steak dinner on uh actually let me show you hang on let me show you what i ate my steak dinner on here dad pull that out so i sat on the couch no joke i ate it when ellie stays here this is her elmo desk this is what i ate my my steak dinner on was uh was this elmo desk so uh and my mom sat over here with her computer desk because they had all their stuff out over over here so um yeah and they just now left so now we can rant and rave about those people um so anyway but mom you said you enjoyed your steak dinner right it was delicious. all right so we got mom the steak we dinner, best steak dinner i've ever had got mom the most expensive porterhouse on the menu mm -hmm. and uh and she had that you had a baked potato yes now you only probably ate what like half of it Oh, I ate the whole baked potato. Uh, but you did you eat? Steak? Yeah, the steak. Oh, the steak. I have a ton of it left over. It's delicious. Oh, the nice, best. nice, yeah. nice. And Dad, you got some steak tips. Steak tips. Oh man, they look good. They were great. Caramelized onions. Awesome. Well, I actually did mushrooms. Didn't... Yeah, 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 yeah. I had to sit with them in my lap and pick at them, it felt cursing like a under my breath. <laughs> It was like a Seinfeld episode. It felt like a Seinfeld episode. It really it was, was, wasn't it? it was. I had to see the humor in it. You mm -hmm. know, I. I I refuse to get mad. So. Yeah. yeah, and, yeah, you can't get mad. I mean, and the thing is, old now, so. I couldn't, I couldn't, yeah. <laughs> no, now you can just become one of those crotchety old people. Nah. Um, no, so like for me, I, uh, I, I don't, I don't, I didn't deal well with it myself. I know, because I'm the one, on you know, like. Like I am, I did it with complete joy for my folks, but I'm sitting here like we just bought this not inexpensive steak dinner and we brought it back, and now like these people, and not only that, sitting like sitting around the campfire. Not only that, but like I'm one of those kinds of guys. I don't care what your religious persuasion is. I don't know. I don't care what it is. It is classless to walk into a stranger's home and just sit there and drop f bomb after f bomb after f bomb, which is what this guy did. <laughs> And it was just like, we're sitting here trying to have a nice little family dinner on the Elmo desk and the computer desk in the living room. And they're sitting over here like, no good, bleep, 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 bleep. And you know, mom. And then the thing is, what you keep hearing is bleep, 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 bleep. Oh, this is the best steak I've ever had. <laughs> bleep, 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 plumbing, bleep, bleep, bleep. Oh, this steak is just so good. It's it really good butter. It's a good steak. Really I'm, so I'm really glad for that. I'm glad. But now it's birthday cake time. Yes. So what we have is a variety cake. Uh, honestly, I only bought it from Walmart, but we've done this before and uh, it's super good. So we've got red velvet, German chocolate, carrot, and chocolate fudge, and, uh, and just the three of us. So uh, we need a fourth person to eat the other big piece of cake. Here we go. Oh, this was my mom's good go. call, Dad. There we go. We'll eat it in the spirit of Ellie, who she is... Can eat it with I was going to say that she can be the fourth person. Yeah, she can be the fourth person. Can you imagine, like, the next time that Shanna and Ellie come uh, over here, there's a bunch of chocolate crammed all over this painting, <laughs> this picture. So uh, this was my mom's uh, birthday present from Ellie. Yeah, it is uh, it. just a picture that my mom took of Ellie that we had made up um, and printed. 
and uh, awesome. yeah, just a bright shining oh, smile gosh. and her little ponytail. Yeah. And uh, Ellie's on her way to Phoenix right now. She's on the yeah. plane to this Phoenix. This will help us get through. Uh, missing her. Are you gonna Are you gonna keep looking at the photo? I have to. When you, yeah. We'll just put Ellie right here, yeah. <laughs> and she'll be overlooking all this cake. So, all right, guys, we're gonna eat some birthday cake and continue on with some birthday fun. Yeah. All right. So as you guys can see, I take a lot of cream in my coffee. <laughs> but um, now, actually, we don't have any glasses, but we've decided to all drink whole milk in honor of Ellie because basically, yeah. without Ellie here, that whole milk is going to go bad. So we yeah. buy whole milk every week and leave it here for her, and mm -hmm. she's gone, so we don't want it to go bad. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So in but honor of Ellie, milk, so cheers! So. Cheers with whole milk in coffee cups. We love you, Miss Ellie. <laughs> and happy birthday Woo, to Mimi. Mimi! All right, let's dig in. Officially, an old lady. So nothing says family fun like an old GameCube Mario Kart game, and uh, I won. I'm pretty sure I won. So um, yeah, this is uh, we haven't done this in a long time. I uh, ever since uh, fifth grade, my family has been a gaming family, and so this is uh, my parents though, as old school gamers, have some cool old school consoles like this GameCube and. It's always been traditional for us to jam out a little bit on Mario Kart. And uh, the last time that Mom beat me at this game... I won. Was... Did I win? Um, did you? I'm Princess. You are a princess. I think that should be a meme. Her going thumbs up going, I'm Princess. I won. I won. Um, I that was you? you? Yes. Yeah. I don't think you were friends. No, no, no. Wow, Is we got it on film. film. I, would like, I would like to point out the fact, though, the reason I won three out of four races, and the one that I lost, I lost really bad because I was talking with Dad with my head turned you you back go. there. Ooh. And then I, I got mixed up where I was. I thought I was on the top <laughs> and I was on the bottom. So... Oh, anyway, well, happy, happy. <laughs> he won't put this on. Happy too. birthday! All right, let's move on. Let's uh, yeah, right. <laughs> move on to the next race. All right, I just uh, thought I'd film my mom trying to catch up. Oh, stop! This is me on the bottom. This is goal and yeah. first place. Sure, he has to make himself look good now. This is one of the hardest, Yahoo! the hardest screens. It is. Hmm. Okay, eighth place. So, eighth place. That's right. Now, is that last place on this game? I can't I remember. Is it. eighth? Eighth is the last one. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's okay. okay. Well. It's okay. You can't win them all. It's fun. I play for the. I play for the fun of it all. Yeah. Was that fun getting eighth place? Not really. <laughs> Oh, this is my winning ceremony. Yeah, Ready? See, he has to gloat. This dun, is difference here. Dun, when I win, I don't gloat. Dun, 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 Look at all the birthday confetti falling from the sky. He's a bloater. Mm hmm. First yeah. place. Yeah. Rewind this video and see who won the last time. Uh huh. Actually, that was a while ago. Yeah. Why don't you tell them how many times I've won since then? Oh, or at 60, have you forgotten? <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. Yeah. All right, guys, we've had an awesome time celebrating my mom's birthday, and I've just got confirmation from my mom that on tomorrow's vlog, my parents are going to come over to the house, and for the first time ever, my mom is going to play PlayStation VR. Now, my mom has never experienced anything like VR before, which, uh, if you think Mario Kart is cool, oh, wait till you get inside of a VR headset. So, uh, guys, make sure to check that out on tomorrow's vlog. We're gonna get my mom playing <laughs> VR 
and uh, I think that's going to be a lot of fun. My dad's tried it before, and he it. has an idea of what I'm getting her into. So I think she's going to enjoy it. I think she's going to have fun. Uh, there's a couple of experiences that could be a little jumpy. <laughs> Yeah, he's just gonna stay silent. He's like, I gotta see this. I gotta see this go down. So, can I play Rush of Blood one more time? Yes, you can play it all <laughs> you want. All right. So tomorrow, make sure to check out uh, Ellie's grandmother playing PlayStation VR. Well, I'm back home, and I got a call from Shannon. She said that the second plane ride of the day was a little rougher. Ellie's getting tired. She's hungry. She's probably tired of sitting in Mommy's lap, and Mommy is probably getting tired of keeping Ellie in her lap. That was a four-and-a-half-hour ride. So uh, when she called me, they were in Phoenix, Arizona. Their next plane uh, takes them to Santa Barbara. Uh, where they're going to get picked up and they can just get in the car at that point. So, uh, been kind of a rough middle of the day for them. Here's hoping Ellie falls asleep. Uh, but once they're there, they're there, and I hope they have a fantastic week. But pretty good day so far for my day number one, being home alone. Went ahead and enjoyed my mom's birthday. We ate some cake, we had some steak, we played some games, had some laughs. It was a really good time. Uh, make sure to check out the video tomorrow because tomorrow my parents are coming over to try out the PlayStation VR. Now my mom has never been in anything like that before. Um, she's used to old games, old games like you saw today, like Mario Kart. So it'll be a lot of fun to get her reaction. Ellie's Mimi, Mimi as we call her, Ellie's Mimi is going to play PlayStation VR tomorrow. So make sure to check out that video on our channel. Um, but. Shannon, Ellie, I love you guys so much. You've only been gone since this morning, and I miss you like crazy. I know you're watching this video in your downtime in California, so I just want to say I love you, I miss you, I wish you the best, and I hope you have a fantastic time, and, uh, and you get a lot of good video footage, and you have a lot of good stories to tell when you come home. So I will see you next week, and I will probably be on Skype every day with you. I love you guys to death, and I miss you to death. Uh, guys, thanks so much for tuning into the video. Make sure to drop a like on this and subscribe. Also, check out all of our social media links in the description down below. And don't forget to check out tomorrow's video, Mimi Tries the PlayStation 4. It's going to be, or I would just call it this, Mimi Tries PlayStation VR. It's going to be awesome. We'll see you guys next time.